you will not believe what this beautiful, fully restored 1960 23 window Volkswagen Microbus sold for at a no reserve auction. Watch to the end because there's a surprising twist. This beautiful 1960 Volkswagen Microbus is equipped with what was nicknamed the Samba Package. The Samba Package came with coveted front split windshield that unlatched in the front so it can tilt open. It also has the four small portal windows on top for a total of 23 windows and the coveted skylight fabric sliding roof. The 23 window Samba was in production from 1951 to 1963. From 1964 to 1966, the Sombra Microbus was called the 21 window. Due to tighter safety regulations, the two wraparound rear windows were replaced with stronger roof pillars, thus making it only a 21 window van. But they can still fetch a very hefty price at auction. In 2017, a 1961 fully restored 23 window Samba microbus was sold for $291,000 and still holds the record today for the highest selling Samba microbus. This bus is also fully restored. Well, why don't we go inside and see how it does in the auction? Really popular. 40, 2, 5, hit 40 pounds, they're going to be 40, 2, 5, 5, 5, get the street right, they got 40,000 on the floor, I need 40, 2, 5, hit 40, 2, 5, 100, I'm going to give you a ticket to be 5, 100, I'm going to give you a ticket to be 5, 100, I'm going to give you a ticket to be 5, 5, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, 40, 2, 5, What the hell? This one only sold for $40,000? It can't be. How can one sell for $291,000 and this one only sell for $40,000? Well, I did a little digging. It turns out that this van was most likely not made in Germany, but was made in Brazil. Brazil produced the Volkswagen Microbus from 1950 all the way up to December 2013 and had a production run of over 3.5 million microbuses. With the high demand for a documented German Samba microbus, this has created a market for clone 23 window microbuses. With millions of microbuses being built in Brazil, there's plenty of chassis to choose from to make a clone. All you need to do is find a good chassis, cut off the roof, buy the parts for a Samba van, weld them in, and voila, you have a 23 window clone. I'm not sure if this is the case with this van, if it really is a clone or did it start out its life in Brazil as a real 23 window Samba. But without proper documentation, it's hard to tell. The buyer also has to be concerned that if it is a clone, how was the build quality? After all, welding on a new roof with a massive skylight in the center is not an easy task. The buyer can only hope that the builder did a good job putting this van together. But what do you think? Is it worth the risk for $40,000? It is a great looking van, but will it hold its value? And will it be a good investment? Let me know what you think in the comments below. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time.